Hey cuties, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. I am Shiro. And today we're gonna to be talking about a kit gun. I haven't I don't think I've done a kit gun yet, so we're gonna be doing a tomb finger for pistol. I've done like a tomb finger like a rifle build before and it's okie dokie. Um the finger one the the finger one. Ha! Huh? The pistol version is a lot better. Um faster fire rate, high crit. Um also uh, to support the channel, share share the videos, it helps out, liking the videos helps out too. Also, um, channel's getting kind of dry for me, like, I don't mind doing build videos, I do want to switch it up, so if you guys have any ideas of, like, what you want to see, like, maybe some indie games, because a lot of indie games are free, so I can uh, do some playthroughs of that, or, um, if you have, like, maybe some Warframe ideas, just put them down in the comments below. And um, if you keep coming back to the channel, subbing really helps. And yeah, so that's out of the way. So for this build, we have the Tomb Finger. That's the main part. Splat and Ramble. Now, basically, it's like a flak pistol. So a flak gun, it basically just shoots like a big spread. But for being a flak gun, it has range. Um, yeah, mine has like 38% crit chance. But... I know, and I said, oh, crit. But you don't really need... Oh, actually, I do. I don't know why I wasn't showing that before. Weird. All right, anyways. So we have high crit, 114, and a 4.8 uh, times multiplier. And we got heat, radiation, and viral. So any kit gun you make is going to have radiation. So that's passive. So that you can add other stuff. That way you have, like, three elementals. I have viral. I love viral. Viral is amazing um f heat is amazing as well heat is a constant burn and it makes uh, defense easier to crack through so we have hornet strike galvanized diffusion creeping bullseye lethal torrent scorch prime target cracker pistol pestilence frostbite and we have pack seeker which is awesome so on headshot it'll create four projectiles that will seek out other enemies and then secondary merciless. Alright. And we're gonna be using Urelli. So when you're moving around Urelli, you get 200% crit chance. So that adds onto the crit chance I already have. And we're gonna have some fun. So basically, a lot of orange numbers here. Let's start gathering these guys up. It's just straight, like, orange numbers, which is great. Now, there we go. So you, you can start seeing them get melted there. You gotta be careful with these guys. They do a lot of damage. Yeah, but we're melting, though. And radiation also, if it procs, it causes... Um, enemies to shoot at their teammates. This is just like a combat scenario, pretty much. Now, for the most part, like, you really is, like, skateboard will, like, uh, tank damage, but damage will still pass through, like, primarily Slash. Slash is still one of the most broken status effects in the game. And if the board breaks, you can just recall it. It costs nothing. I like Ureli a lot now since they fixed um, that gun glitch that she was having. That was like my main reason why I wasn't using her. After this, I'll just show like one enemy standing still so you can see the damage. And I'm out of ammo. Ever since they took away the max ammo out of the Merciless, it's, it kind of sucks. You don't need it. 
it was a nice thing to have. But, you know, people ruin it. People asking for nerfs on a PvE game, like, it it's beyond me. Alright, so anyways, we're going to take this off, and we are going to put just one of these guys here. And we're going to make them stay still, pause, and simulate. So, now we're just going to go by ourselves, and... As you can see, it's like kind of like a shotgun spread. But yeah, look at that. It does damage. And then, when I said it had range, it actually does have a pretty decent range. So. Now the thing is, it's not going to be as effective. It's still going to proc, you know, like fire and viral and all that. And a decent fire rate. So it, it does pretty uh, a good damage. Um, there is another pistol that's like it now, which I will talk about that in a different video, but basically the Kuva Kraken. So I'll just equip it so you can see it real quick. Same thing, it's a flak pistol. Now I'll just show you, it's basically the same deal. Now, with the Kuva Kraken as a flat crystal, it melts. So, compared to like the normal Kraken, which just shoots two tiny bullets and does jack shit, the Kuva Kraken is actually pretty damn amazing. But, we're not talking about that. If you guys want to see a, a video of, of that, then sure. But yeah, this is mine. It's the Finger Blaster. If you copy the name, just put like a 2 or 3 or whatever. But yeah. It will proc a bunch of statuses. And since it's a flak pistol, it does have pretty damn good crowd control. But yeah, that's it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. And like I said, give me ideas down below. And see you guys next time. So take care.